Hello and welcome to Space Marine. With the, uh, not with the tra trailer, I guess, with the coming Space Marine 2, I wanted to do a playthrough of Space Marine just to put it on the channel. So that way I can play Space Marine 2 immediately after, or at least after when it comes out. But it'll be great. It'll be great. Anyways, I've already beaten this game multiple times. I love this game. Dun dun dun. Captain Titus, the orcs have massacred the Forge World's forces. And they have taken the planetary defense weapons. Look at his helmet, it's so cool. Why can't we put it on him? I know there's mods for it. Brace for Pilot, report. Starboard engine is dead, Sergeant. We are losing altitude. Get the ship to safety. We find another way down. Hi, Captain. Found a whole class of Joe returning to launch bay. Now this is a plan, brother. This is your plan. We need Great to get plan. to the surface to take out the gun battery. Or do you want to go home already, Sergeant? Not before having a word or two with the orcs. The orcs, yeah, I love exactly. this guy. The Codex Astartes does not support this action. Shut up. Try to keep up. For those of you who don't know, the Codex Astartes is basically made by the Primarch of the Ocean Marines. Dun dun! Do, 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 do. Ah! Also, I have a controller plugged into my Xbox, meaning I can play like an Xbox player. But I suck with PC controls. Let's go for the Emperor! Also, if it lets me do it, Space Marines don't heal through freaking health packs. We, through, we heal through the execution of our enemies. See how? See, okay, so look at my health. Look at my health. See that? Now watch. I'm going to get more health. Ta-da! Oh. And there he is, Warbok, Warboss Grimskull. I'm pretty sure his name is. There we go. Woo! You can have that grenade. There you guys go. See, I'm very generous when it comes to giving grenades. Oh, oh, Spartan. Spartan kick. I mean, look how covered in blood I am. Also, works. Works not the brightest, as you are about to see. Uh, maybe, just maybe, they should stop firing once they've noticed they've been pushed towards their own ship. But you know what? It helped me, so I don't really mind. Hey, look! I think we're gonna land. Thank you for flying Delta Airlines. Wait for it. And title card. You gotta love it. Captain Titus, come in. Hello. Orc shot me off course. I've had no word from Leandros, but I'm picking up Vogt. Jack oh, from Imperial sorry. Guard forces on the ground. I scarcely thought anyone would be left alive, much less still fighting. Heading towards the front lines now. I will meet you there. Oh yeah, so people really don't like Leandros, including me, and you are going to see why. In a few, it, as as we as we progress through this game, you will understand as to why multiple people do not like Leandros. The the holy bolter. I know I don't shoot things. Die. Ow. Base Marines are sensitive. I hate orcs. Captain, destroy them. Hello. You know, the greatest way to go through a bunch of orcs is through melee. However, you're going to really want to be good with bolters. 
because of situations like this. And two, a bolter round isn't like a regular isn't like a regular round. Bolters have explosive cores in them, and when they like fire, they're like rocket propelled, and then they dig into their enemy, and then it, when they're like deep embedded inside their enemy, they explode. It's freaking awesome. Bolters are so freaking cool, man. Damn, took his kneecaps out. He's dead? I, I promise you he's dead. He is dead! Are you wounded? The Codex Astartes warns against using jump packs to leap blindly into enemy fire and for good reason. Your days as a novice are behind you. Why do you still interpret the Codex so narrowly? I looked at its rules for guidance. We all do. But there are also benefits to thinking for yourself. Enemy! Sight it! Oh, hey, look, more guys. Sorry, I just finished choking on my water I was drinking in the middle of the cutscene. Oh my god, he's... does he... does he... oh. Sedona's picked up local Imperial Guard communications. They survived under the shadow of that gun. I want to know how. I love this guy's voice. I think it... I'm pretty sure it was Mark Strong that voiced this guy, if I remember correctly. Hey, guys! No, they... How can you do that to me, man? Don't run from me. Kill okay. Don't kill me. Don't run away from me either. Oh, hey, look, it's the Imperial Guardsmen. My favorite faction. Or my favorite units. Ah, no! Why would you do that? Oh. Bonk. Bonk. Now, as you can see, we have quite a height advantage on these guys. But see, the thing is, it's not about... It's not that, like the armor gives us a boost or anything. We actually have, like, genetic... Like, Space Marines have genetic altering in them that makes them, like, really big. I think they're, like, seven feet or so. They got two hearts and three lungs and built-in night vision in their eyes. More like... Yeah, I don't think anyone's getting meeting any quotas while the invasion is having its has uh, you know taken place. Hey. I see you found something to keep you busy. Worry not, Captain. I've saved some orcs for you. The orcs have got that gun well defended, no mistake. Typical orc behavior would be to dismantle or destroy the gun. And certainly not use it to keep our forces at bay. There's a strategy behind it. Their leader is no fool. This day is getting interesting. I may have encountered the orc during our jump to the surface. Oh, baby. My favorite melee weapon. Itself, it's still under his control. And you can still use the bolt pistol with it, too. Oh, it's amazing. Oh, and some fresh meat to turn out on! Die! For the Emperor! Hold on. Hold on. You... Mine. Kill! Die. Oh, man. The freaking shoulder charge on this man. And boop. Hey, look, ammo. Ah, yeah. oh, that was a bad idea. But as one, I shall repeat. 
There we go. Hey, bro, watch this. Well, of course, there's plenty of them. There's freaking orcs. Oh, yeah. Into outer space. Ow, never melee a freaking explosive barrel. Brought to you by your local space marine. I'll wait for it. Uh, anyone want to come down here so I can take their health? Anyone? Anyone at all? Actually, wait a minute. I need health. One second. Thank you for your patronage. And here's Mr. Big Boy. And one, two, ow. One, two, three. There we go. Spam. Punk. And now he has no head. Hold the line. And stay alive. I, Lieutenant. Uh. Thank the Emperor. Second Lieutenant Mira, 203rd Cadian Regiment. Sir. Captain Titus of the Ultramarines. You are. I'm all that's left, my lord. Unless my commanders rise from the grave. So far, they seem content to stay put. Lieutenant, the scouts have returned to forward base. How many? Two. Damn. I sent out ten. That damn gun. We don't have the numbers to make an assault. And as you might have seen, it's shooting down all our support vessels. That is why we are here. Leave the gun to us. Come with me, then. I should warn you, my lords. We've got a slight orc problem down here. No shit. Get me that field manual. Stuck on bloody forge world and not a single tech priest in sight. That's gotta suck. Oh. What do you think I was aiming at? Hold on, guardsmen. I'm coming. Hold on, guardsmen. Okay, never mind. This is mine now. Oh, all right. I'm not afraid to use this. Don't step in front of the guy using a giant machine gun. It won't end well for you. I promise it. Oh, that was fun. And the gun battery. Ow. Now none of our ships can get past them. Oh, baby. The Stalker Bolter. It's just a sniper rifle, but with bolter rounds. That's where the I'm all chunky. The gun battery. We haven't been able to make it inside the wall. There just aren't enough of us. You have survived this long on your own, Lieutenant. You have done well. But you are no longer alone. We will retake the gun. You will get your reinforcements. I'll hold you to that, Captain. Seek treatment in Sector 46. Oh, hold on. Let me show you the power of the Stalker Bolter. If he ever decides to show his head again. Oh. There we go. Oh, look at that. Turned his head into pulp.
I'm very inaccurate with this thing, if you couldn't tell. Hey, bro, watch this. Uh, that'll do. Aw. And, uh-oh, well, that was a four-level grenade. You don't even need to aim down sights with this thing. Ow. Alright, you know what? Feel the Emperor's Fury! Oh, baby. were dropped in this area oh and they have my favorite thing the jump packs oh oh yeah oh yeah oh you know I'm going to Vince in this Oh. Hey guys. Oh jeez. You guys having problems? Don't even worry about it. Oh, don't even. All right, I just sent him to the shadow realm, I guess. It... Oh. Oh, I didn't let me do the ground pound. Oh, just oh my gosh, it's so satisfying just that big pile getting absolutely obliterated. Hey look, I'm learning not to dive directly into a bunch of never mind. They're good though. Let us go forth. No. I think I'm beginning to see how they got into the gun fortress. Oh yeah, the vengeance launcher. Vengeance launcher. That sounds promising. Here, Captain. Melter charges. Put those in the right Ooh. place, and this whole fortress will come down. We could put the charge on one of the gun shells. Leandros, you do the chapter proud. If only you knew, my friend. If only you knew. Oh yeah, I hold up. I have a vengeance launcher. Oh yeah. Probably is a waste of a very powerful weapon, but I do not care. The Vengeance Launcher is fun. So would you... Oh, dang. Grenade. Alright, you wanna charge at me? I could use the health anyways. Thank you. Hey. Get back here. Get back- oh, okay, never mind. 
Oh, hey. All right. I did as he asked. Woo! Come and get me, Spice Marine. Get him to face. As you wish. There. I will place the charge on that shell. Oh yeah. Now to move the shell into place. Oh. Oh, oh my gosh, I forgot how awesome this scene is, man. Oh my gosh, you're gonna love this. You guys are gonna enjoy this part. To the gun's chamber. We cannot rely on luck for this, Sir Dunnis. We follow the shell up and make sure it reaches its destination. Alright, now back to the lift. Marine. Yep, we definitely should not all let luck with the bullet. Oh yeah, I forgot I had this. And look, he's even more beautiful. We put it back. Leandros, get the shell into that loader. I will cover you. Move your ass, Lynn Andrews. Alright. If you would be so kind. It's just so fun. Bonk. Now come here! Mmm. Oh, deep throat him. Keep going, Leandros. Thank you. Firing now. Agreed. Yeah, that would be best. Let's go. And we're not dead. And for some reason, I'm the only one covered in blood. Housekeeping. Anyone home? I think that doesn't know. The Adeptus Mechanicus are masterful. Their work outlived all of them. Yeah, I get it, because they all died. Well, hmm, I think... He should win. Hey, where are you going, man? I just want you to fight. Yeah, that didn't exactly work all that well for you, did it? The Adeptus Mechanicus, if it's ever brought up again, is a group of, like... It's basically a religious group of people who believe in something called the Omnisaya. The Omnisaya is like the machine god. And like all technology is sprouted from that. And they like to do blessings and holy rites and all that stuff for every single machine in the Imperium. All the way from like a, like a power drill to like a giant war class type. It's, a, it's, it, it's, it's pretty crazy. Now to stop this ram. Time to impact. Time enough. We've got six minutes. Oh, <laughs> we're starting to fly! Alright, hold on one second. I want my health back from trying to do this combo on you for 20 minutes! Deep throat my chainsword. Yes. Time to impact. Less than four minutes. 
trains. Yeah. These trains have good defense turrets. There'll be a heavy weapon ahead. Forward. Jeez, these trains have point defense turrets, man. Everything has a turn on it. That is why I like the Imperium. Everything is defensed. I'm pretty sure a playground in the Imperium would have like 50 cow turrets on it and AA in AA guns. Ow! All right, all right. I get it. I get it. I get it. You have a big, you have a big cool turret. Stop shooting me! Shooting me and just letting and just letting yourself die. You should really try it sometime. Whoa, 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 whoa. Alright, I get it, I get it. No! Oh gosh! Just die already, please. It means so much to me. You cannot be this tanky. It's dead now. Oh, that can't be good. Hey, guys. This is the second time we've survived a horrible crash. We must disable that crane. Bonk. Oh, freaking grab the right dude. Oh, baby. Sorry. Give me my health. Listen, it is not going to go well for you in about three seconds. Like, I mean. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That was amazing. Forward. Clear out the orcs. Oh, this is worse. Uh oh. Oh gosh. I didn't mean to no, not you. Why would you do that? Tell me why. Alright, it's time to pull out the vengeance. Oh, I blew myself off! <laughs> we cannot allow uh, that. Let's not ha let that happen then. Oh, that's a big ass plasma gun. That works. My lords, you must hurry. The green skins are on the move again. If they find the access point we are using, we will not last long. <laughs> You'll be fine, you're a guardsman. The planet broke before the guard did. Ooh. Huh. I'm sensing an issue here. An entire horde. Antioch, hold the lift. We have orcs inbound. And... All right, fine. You want this many orcs? Take the might of the Imperium. Uh, any more orcs? Yeah, that's what I thought. 
Uh, listen, man. I know we weren't haven't been friends for the longest time, but I really I'm really gonna need you right now. Again, it just all right. Oh gosh, that's two of them. Yeah, definitely, definitely, definitely popping my fury. This is cool. Oh, dang. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I know how to use this thing. Disintegrated. Wrong gun. Thank you, guys. Yes, my lord. We have word that an Inquisitor is in the Manufactorum. Yes, Lord Drogon. We have not seen him for several days. Has the Liberation Fleet arrived, my lord? The fleet is still en route, Corporal. The Ultramarines are here as a vanguard. To cripple the enemy and secure the most valuable assets. I see. But the facility and its titans remain secure. All I can say for certain is that no orc has breached this gate, my lord. Contact Lieutenant Mira. Her unit is establishing a bastion in Hab Center Andres, and your support craft now have a viable approach from orbit. What of the colonel and his staff? They did not survive. That's a lot of turrets. Oh, yeah. Now I'm erect. Coming out of the walls. Repeat authorization. Hello. Prepare the power source for immediate release. One moment. Repeat authorization. Hi, how are you? Inquisitor Drogon. I am Drogon. Captain Titus of the Ultramarines. We received your distress call, but you seem to have weathered the enemy's attack. I am soldier and scientist, both, Captain. What is the status of the experimental device? The power source is running the entire manufactorum from the generator room. This device is a fuel source, not a weapon? It is a complex device and an unstable one. If the Orcs find it, they'll try and take it apart. It could detonate with enough force to destroy the entire planet. Then we must move it to safety. And for that, Captain, I need your aid. This way. You are wounded, Inquisitor Drogon. I'm a Psyker. My psychic abilities are controlling the bleeding. Very well. Alright, well with that, I think I'm going to end it for now. Uh... Thanks for watching and uh, see ya.